Dr. Tedisetso Matlanyani says the Monetary Policy Committee has done this study considering the international, regional and domestic economic development in pursuit of the Central Bank of Lesotho's mandate of maintaining price stability. She also stressed that the risks of 2019 economy are surrounded by the trade negotiation between China and United States and also by a decline in crude oil prices due to increase of U.S. oil production. The slowdown is expected to result from the carryover into 2019 of the slow growth momentum that was experienced in 2018 in some advanced and emerging market economies. This happened mainly in the second half of 2018. There are some risks to the outlook uh, and these uh, risks are tilted to the downside and emanate from the ongoing trade tensions and the uncertainty surrounding ongoing trade negotiations between China and the United States. They also emanate from the increased volatility in global financial markets and weaker outlook for some advanced economies. She further indicated that even though economic activity increased earlier this year, the annual rate in inflation has remained unchanged since January and February 2019. Now, coming to our own domestic economic conditions. Economic conditions or economic activity uh, escalated somewhat and slightly in January 2019 relative to the previous month, which was December. The CBL measure of economic activity indicated that output increased marginally only slightly by 0.9% in January 2019, and this is compared with 0.7% in December 2018. So uh, our economy or economic activity is still not very satisfactory and very much subdued. Um, the slight economic activity that we saw, or the slight pickup in economic activity that we saw was mainly supported by higher uh, domestic demand, but we see that the production side weakened. Matabora Matlanyani, reporting for LTV News, Masiru.